Welcome back to the Mad Spideyverse. I'm Mad Spidey. Thanks once again for tuning into my channel. Uh, I realised that it's been almost a month since I've done one of my artist series. Um, generally, my artist series is my one of my mainstay series that I do on my channel. Uh, for those of you who are you know watching this video and don't know what my artist series is. This is episode 21, so I do have a playlist that you can go back and watch the uh, previous episodes. Basically, being an original art collector, even though I've sort of put it on the back burner a bit recently um, and done a bit more focus on um, my uh, comic, like the actual book collecting, um, but I do have quite an extensive um, array of uh, original art mainly commissions that's um pretty much what i've collected over the years i do have a few pages here and there but pretty much just commission work from a lot of different artists so what i generally do is i will pick um either i'll go through my folders and pick a piece if it's an artist that i have multiple pieces of um then i will show the multiple pieces from the one artist um so generally artist series is based on on a one particular artist depending on whether i have one piece or i have 20 or 30 pieces however many i have from that particular artist i will actually show you um today's episode as i said this is episode 21 um this is a episode based on artist tony moore and now you, some people will know him as Colonel Tony Moore. Um, that's one of the monikers that he goes under. But um, yeah, Tony Moore is pretty much, he's probably his main thing that he's known for is the Walking Dead books. Um, he came out to an Australia in, oh, I'd like to say 2013, 2014, somewhere in that sort of vicinity, I think it was. Uh, hang on. 2015 it actually was um so i came out to australia for one of our supernova expos um i had a look at his like i'd heard of him but i didn't actually know a lot about him himself had a look at his um what he's actually done so as i said he's mainly known for the walking dead he has his creator own book i think it's called fear agent and i think there might be another one called uh the exterminators i think it is. is his own creator own book but he's also worked for marvel he's done ghost rider and he's done i think venom and deadpool and a, and a few other bits and pieces but obviously yeah as i said walking dead is uh his main thing that he's known for even though i'm not a i'm not a zombie guy i'm not a you know walking dead sort of fan um obviously you know i like ghost rider i like punisher and I like you know sort of venom and deadpool and things like that it's things that he's actually done and he was actually one of the ones that mainly did agent venom um some people like the design some people don't like the design i actually do like the design of agent venom um so i contacted him prior to him actually coming to australia and i said look mate you're coming to a convention here in my hometown of melbourne can i set up a pre-commission you know to be picked up at the show he was more than happy uh, to do it, it was mainly organised through um, his wife, I think Cara, I think is um, is her name. Very lovely to deal with. They're both awesome people. Um, even just coming up to on the first day on the Saturday, introduced myself here to pick up a piece. They were very lovely, very inviting, very friendly people. Um, so I had an absolute pleasant experience. Um, so yeah, as I said, I did pick agent venom so it was done i could pretty much just go up there i'd already paid for it just pick it up and you know all i you know all i needed to do was just just have a chat so i was having a good chat to him for probably a good 20 30 minutes then obviously realized there was you know a few people uh sort of starting to turn up in the line so you know i went back a couple of times and you know said a quick hello and a few other words and things like that but yeah very very fun very welcoming people so now, as I said, I only got the one piece from Tony. It is a smaller piece because um, he generally does these sort of, they're almost like 9x12s or 10x10s. It's like a weirdish sort of size and it's a, a weird paper. It almost feels like thin chipboard, almost like, you know, like a wood. But um, yeah, very cool piece. Very glad to own this in my collection. And as I said, Agent Venom. So just, just the detail. 
you just have a look at his, you know, on his shoulders and things like that. Just the amount of detail that he put into that is just crazy. So there's his signature on the bottom there. And even just the way he just did the background, something very simple but very effective. So yeah, so there's the uh, there's the piece there. So yeah, very very glad to actually uh, own this in my collection. Yeah, so there you go. So Agent Venom by Tony Moore. So that's it for this uh, this episode. Nice quick episode. Thank you once again for tuning in. Obviously hit the thumbs up, leave a comment if you feel so inclined, and don't forget, if you're not subscribed, hit that subscribe button. So I'm edging closer and closer to the 350 mark. Obviously, I want to try and aim for a 400, but, you know, it'll just come when it's come. I've got one of those snail channels where it's just one here, one there, but I'm fine because I'm, I'm having fun. I'm meeting heaps of uh, cool people and making a lot of good friends. So thanks once again for tuning in. Hope you enjoy the rest of your day, and Spidey out.